Hey guys, what's going on? CJ here from Hockey 101 here, and I'm bringing you the first tutorial on my channel. Today what we're going to be talking about is a pretty basic skill, but it's a very important skill, and it is how to lift the puck. This is one of the most important skills in hockey, because if you can't lift the puck, your accuracy is going to be horrible, and you won't be able to get too many goals on the ice. This is really aimed toward the younger players, I'd say from maybe uh, Squirt and Might. Uh, but if you are a higher level player, you can still use this, make sure you're doing it the right way, and I'll learn a couple of drills to practice how to do it. Uh, so, really what we're going to be working on is how to release it, how to get it in the air, obviously, and uh, how to really improve your accuracy with the lifting of the puck. So, we're going to talk right about that. I'll go out on my shooting pads right now. Okay, guys, so the first skill you're really going to need to learn here in lifting the puck is how to hold your stick the right way. So, I know when I was a beginner, I held the stick a little bit like this. I'm going to be perfectly honest. You're not going to be able to get every, any leverage on that, as you can see. So, make sure you're holding it right at the butt of the stick. You want to hold it right here. That way, you can get your maximum power out of it. Your lower hand can really be anywhere you want it. I would not recommend having it like this, like a baseball bat, but put it right here maybe, or right here. It depends on how you want it. I mean, I would recommend like right around here. It's probably good to get that good wrist shot. So this one is for uh, the younger players out here. I would not recommend starting with the huge, you know, really far back release it. I would really start with just a little chip. That's going to be most goalies your age. Um, so just try and get the puck on the heel. And just kind of get under it as much as you can. Just lift the stick up with you. It's not going to work if you, if you go like this. It's only going to work really if you go like this. Like really lift up the stick. Okay, now the more advanced way of shooting a puck is obviously to bring it back. For those beginner players, once again, the first thing I want to have you do is you really, I, I sometimes like to start at the heel out almost. Um, so it's really up to you how you want to do this. Um, but for those younger players out there looking to begin the shot and get a powerful one off, not just that little chip, you're going to want to roll the puck off your stick. So it's going to really, well, it's going to go, for me it goes, uh, heel to toe, but I think it's really up to you. You can really customize that the way you want to do it. You can go uh, toe to heel too. Next up, now if you're really advanced, well not really advanced, just, you know, you're up to this level, if you can go the three back, you keep it in the middle of your stick. You don't roll it at all. It stays in the middle of your stick, and you get the good power control. So, you're going to have it, keep it in the middle of your stick, you're going to put your glove about halfway down the stick, you're going to pull it back, pull it back, use the weight transfer, step forward and release it, like that. Um, another really uh, small thing you can do, just a little chip, if you want to, you can put it in the middle of your stick once again. This is not, this is kind of like the heel chip, except it's a little bit harder to match it. Gets it a little bit higher, so you gotta be careful with that one. That's just the middle uh, of the stick chip. You really don't have to move at all for that one. Here's one way you can improve your accuracy with the shot. Lift the stick to how high you want the puck to go. If you don't want the puck to go that high, you're gonna lift your stick very little. If you want the puck to go really high, you're going to lift your stick really high. You want it to go like medium. You're going to lift it medium. Okay? So you guys kind of get the process. If you really don't want it to go high, keep your blade closed the whole time. If you want it to go really high, keep your blade open when you release it. Like that. Um, and so on. Say you want to move towards a... Put it in one of the top corners. You're going to use your foot to point to that corner. So say I want the left corner. I'm going to point my foot and hopefully I should get it in. Unlike that. Very good. You guys kind of get the idea. I can't do it though. Um, 
Say I want the right, top right corner. Point your foot towards the top right corner and when you release. And uh, you get a pretty nice goal here. Let's see if I can actually do it. There we go. That's basically the basics of lifting your shot up. I'll see you back in my garage. Okay guys, so I really hope you enjoyed that video. I really hope it improved your skills. Make sure to those younger players, you always work on lifting the puck. That is going to be a huge weapon, especially as you get up in the league. Um, leave any suggestions in the comments you want to know about. Uh, next video, I plan to do stick handling, but if you guys got any other suggestions, go ahead and leave them in the comments. I'll make sure you hit a thumbs up on this video. And uh, go ahead and subscribe to Hockey 101. Bunch of new videos coming out. Uh, we already have a bunch already. This is the first tutorial, like I said. Bunch more coming up. So I uh, can't wait for those, but you guys can't either. So we're going to... Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you're really utilizing the puck roll. If you're especially those younger players, let the puck roll to the heel and then release it. Uh, for those older players, the more power, you want to get it right in the middle of the stick. So it's really up to you. If you think you can handle it for the younger players on the on the middle of the stick, go ahead and do that. If you think you can just handle like the little chip, do that too. That will really help. As long as you get the puck in the air, it's a success, I feel like. So just get the puck in the air. Find a way to do it. It doesn't. There's so many ways to play hockey. There's no right or wrong way to play the game of hockey. That's why it's such a fun game because you are really never wrong. You may be doing it a different way that doesn't get as much power, and that's why the coach tells you, "Hey, do it this way." That like if you're not getting the power, I mean that's still the correct way to play hockey. You're, you're releasing the puck. If you can get goals that way, then go ahead and do it that way. If you get goals this way, do it this way. It's really up to you. That's just how I prefer it. So just the game of hockey is always changing. There's always new skills involved in it. Um, so just keep on playing the way you want to play, the way that's comfortable, and the way that will get you the more amount of goals, assists, points, whatever. Just play the way that you think is the best way for you. That's all for this video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. I will see you guys later.